Yo, what's going on? Sexy Samuel Under Squad, how you guys doing? I hope you're doing amazing. I'm doing pretty well myself right now. Um, we're playing a little bit of Nox. I tried to get a Nox game beforehand uh, a while ago, maybe if, like a week or two ago. Um, after I did a stream where I did, I, uh, that guy's name is Sweet Cax <laughs> or Sweat Cax. <laughs> okay anyways there's no memes there's no memes uh this god is not good enough to be mimi you kind of just have to roll with the punches when you play this character so what we're gonna do is just that just roll with the punches um not much is gonna go down to be completely honest i'm just gonna play Nox. she got a booty though huh who got a booty? Um, anyways. <laughs> no need to be shy. Anyways. How you guys doing? I hope you're great. I'm doing I'm doing pretty good myself. Right now at least. Minions have spawned. He's probably got mannequin. Just if I had to guess. It is not a mannequin. I would love this. Wait, you're just giving me it? Wait, for real? Why? That's so weird. It's so weird that he would give me that. I feel like he was definitely in a spot good enough to, to defend that. At least try to. Huge damn. Huge damn. Holy crap. That's a really good uh, situation. Use my one. I want to save my two to go for the blue buff right now. Up a mana pot. Up a health pot too, because blue buff is going to probably put the dickens on me. Um. I'm really surprised this guy's giving up buffs. I used my one there because I kind of figured he would want to try to go for, um, he would want to try to go for that blue. Ouch. He didn't. Anyways, we're playing Nox today, N not because I all of a sudden love this character, because I, I think, you know, she's not bad and she's definitely better in Conquest than she is in Duel and she's still not good in Conquest, but, um, I'm playing her because I, I I did a game. Somebody donated for a Nox game on stream, maybe a week ago or something like that, and um, it was an incredibly intense game. I, I was Nox versus Freya, and I ended up winning the game surprisingly to to everyone's disbelief. I ended up winning the game, and it was one of the most intense matches I've ever had. And so I figured, you know, if I can pull out a win with Nox versus Freya. Maybe I can even get a recording. Nice. Nice, nice, nice. Very nice kill. Very nice kill. I did not know that um, placing my two would actually completely disrupt. I'm going to stay. I'm going to be super greedy and I'm going to stay for an extra wave so I can back the full Chronos Pendant. But I didn't know that placing my two would actually interrupt the stun that Morgan has. Or, I guess, the Morgan. is now if you say Morgan, everyone thinks of Morgan Le Fay. Oh, I'm dead. Never mind, he missed. Ow. You don't do very much damage to me. I might be able to kill him. He, uh... Might get a little greedy with it. He took half of his HP for minions. Trying to go for me instead. You gonna get greedy with it or no? Nah, he's not. Respectable. Respectable. I will kill the wave. Let's go back. I missed one minion. No big deal though, honestly. I really want this Chronos Pendant online. And I am gonna go a uh, Chalice because I think the poke damage that Morgan is gonna start placing on me with her two is gonna start being pretty big. I gotta be uh, a little bit mindful of it. Especially because I have no sustain in my build, so. Where are you? There you are, over there. Oh, I 
I just want him to know, like, ow. Um, okay. Okay, he's over there. We're safe, we're safe. I mean, this is looking really good, but you got to keep in mind, like, it's not as easy as it looks. You know what I mean? Well, I guess it's kind of not true. That was really predictable. You should die there. Really predictable that you wanted to stun me, so all I had to do was alt the stun. I could have beads it as well, but ulting it's fine. I'm in no rush. But it, when this game goes late, and it will go late because I can't end early as Nox. Um, but when this game goes late, it's going to be really tough to out-trade the Morgan. Not only because she has stealth, but also because she just has so much damage in her kit. Oh god, please stop. He seems a little bit defeated. Uh, I'm gonna go Book of Thoth now, actually. I want more late game damage. Yeah, he's just dying to minions. Okay, well, um, I guess that's that. Let's play a second game. I'll see you in the next one. Welcome back to game number two, boys. We're fighting Ultra Chris 90s Neath. And we are going to be gaming exactly the same way, I think. Probably. Uh, the poke damage will be a little bit higher, so I think I'm going to go for a more defensive route. In the sense of getting 3 HP pots instead of 3 mana pots. And getting a, a shell instead of anything else, like a beads. I did need a beads before, or an Aegis or whatever I got, because damage. Oh, fuck. Did that hit him? That nah, didn't even hit him. He's clearing. He's clearing. I want him to detonate this. He doesn't have mannequins, so I'm not that scared. Ow, but he does hit hard as a heckle. Ow. Do I clear? No. Does he clear? Uh, not really, actually. Surprisingly. Oh, darn. Um, so neither of us actually cleared. Um. I'm a little low on HP, man. That's the problem. That's the problem. A little low on HP. A little scared of what the future holds for me. I will 3-auto this. I don't really want to tank this. My, my HP is not looking hot. He doesn't have any mana, though, actually. Like, he's got... Well... I mean, saying he has no mana is dumb because he's got a little less than half mana, but... That is a really good for me. You have, like, you have quite literally no mana now. You cannot steal this. Unless I let him steal this with an auto attack, which would be extremely tragic. Nice. I rooted him so he couldn't steal it with an auto. Let's see. I might be able to kill here. Oh, that hit. Oh, nice beats. Might be able to kill still, though. Nice. We actually hit everything and was able to get the kill. That's insane. Let me please get this blue buff. It would be so good for me. Very nice. Very nice. Huge plays. More than likely, I lose my own blue. Because I'm getting greedy for the wave, but... Still more... Ah! Uh, still worth it, probably. Wave is cleared. Go for the blue here.
wonder if I can steal these. Yeah, can't steal them. Did some damage to him, but didn't steal. No worries. This right here will clear. I missed one minion, but it's no big deal. We back. We have full Chronos pendant now, which I actually don't even think I want. Believe it or not, I think I might go first item breastplate here. A life steal and cooldown is going to be or not life steal. I'm sorry. The cooldown and defense is going to be really, really good. I don't want Chronos pendant because obviously that overcaps cooldown. Um, so I think this item will probably just be a rod. Depending on if he goes transcendence into a defensive item, then I'm, it might be something else other than a rod, but I doubt it. My damage is not good, but I don't expect it to be. I have fucking starter item and breastplate. I have 79 power. Wish that hit. Unlucky. But I am okay with this. We have no beads. You have good stuns though. Wonder if he wants to fight me or not. Um, he has backflip, right? Yeah, he's just gonna back. Oh man, I really want to fight this because I feel like I can. But maybe just a little bit too risky. Okay. I want the back, but I also need him to know that I'm the boss here. That was huge for me. That was actually huge for me. I hit the wave and I hit him. It should be free for me. He's not coming over here. The blue buff is spawning. Mm, do I give it up? I think I have to. If I try to not give up that blue and be greedy for it, I think I lose probably my life. Maybe the game. You're just back here. Take the blue. I don't mind. I don't mind. We'll grab this. A couple of HP pots. Or a couple of potions in general. He's going crit chance? Oh, that is not good. You definitely do not go transcendence into crit chance. Transcendence gives you power, but you have no attack speed. You have no sustain. That crit chance isn't going to do anything for you. I missed. Kind of scary. Huge damn. He backflips here. I hit the wall. Guys, perfect. Perfect kill. I actually can't do anything. It's not like I can go and do bull demon. <laughs> it's just not so... So we stand here and we wait. Um, I'm not going to pop my mana pot. I don't think I need to. Not yet. We're vibing. Mm, I missed the one, but he also missed his alt combo. I mean, he obviously he hit the alt. He's neat, but missed the combo associated with the alt. Oh, you backflip here. Your beads. Don't. I'm not scared, surprisingly. Maybe I should be. You're dead. Oh, nice. Nice foresight to heal off the, the weave. Well played. You back? Oh, you don't back here? A lot of people don't know that, but, um, or don't know this, the, the fact I'm about to tell you. But when you hit the one with Nox, 
it actually for some reason and it's probably some like coding error it actually lasts longer than what it shows so you can confirm your dash you know you can confirm your dash on most gods some gods have really really fast jumps like gods like on her where their hitbox leaves the ground before their actual jump does but um on most gods you can actually nearly guarantee your three after your one which is what i did there i should be able to get this i have rod so like yeah that rod is working for me Jeez, dude. Damage on the one is nice. I, to be fair, though, he was low HP, and I do have Rod up the Hootie. So it did work out. Oh, God. Ow. I'm not going to do a whole ton of damage to this Phoenix right now, but, you know, half HP is not bad. Grab this and just leave the premises. He does have his crit chance now. He did finish his wind demon. But I told you, I don't think that uh that kind of crit chance is actually ever gonna do anything. His build just isn't like he's building good items, but they don't correlate with each other. And again, like I, I said yes in yesterday's videos that um I was thinking about doing like a top five mistake kind of video and building was going to be one of the things do it no building was going to be one of the things people uh have a lot of issues with Looks like I am wearing my but i'll just say this now if you build transcendence you're going to be building more crusher beat stick uh Jotuns for more cooldown you're going to be building for your abilities you're not going to be building for your auto attack so right now you you have no attack speed and your build is for hard hitting autos. Well, but it, your autos aren't going to hit hard if you can only throw like if I have faster attack speed than you, you know something's wrong. And I'm a mage. You know what I mean? Like <laughs> He gets attack speed from his crit like when he gets crit. But it's just not enough, man. That might kill him. Nah. It was a good heal. I'll try the corner here. Corner might be able to work. We'll see. Oh, I missed. If I hit the one, it probably killed. Like, I do almost as much damage as him per auto. Oh, he's dead. There it is. There it is. The one into the dash combo. It's really good with Nox and people underestimate it. And again, not many people play Nox in general. She's kind of... Uh, I think... I don't know if she needs to get reworked. Uh, but... She definitely needs to get changed. I don't think enough people play her. And it's for good reason. I just don't think she's good. You know, like... She, her, her kit, it's... It's super hard hitting, but it's very hard to hit. You know what I mean? It's super hard hitting, but it's very hard to hit. Mm. I hit literally just as hard as you right now. Huge damage. Not gonna kill. is not going to kill Let's see where you at he's defending ah oh, bummer hmm 
I need Polly here. I think I need a Polly. The life seal is nice, but more, you know, obviously I need it for the tower. This backflip. I can only do a couple of autos. We'll do a couple of autos before I have to back off. Mm, I am actually comfortable with this. Oh, huge. Insane. Actually insane. Ow. Damn, the Phoenix still one hit those those archers. I was hoping the Phoenix had a two hit. Had a two hit on those archers, because if it did, it would have been really nice. But that's okay. That's okay. Um, so we're get, we got the poly online, it's gonna give us more sustain and obviously more Phoenix damage. But more likely, once I get this Bancrofts online and I upgrade this, stands of time. I'll have max cooldown and I'll have a ton of sustain because I'll actually have built triple lifesteal at that point. Very, very nice. Actually huge. This poly is giving me a lot of extra damage. And a lot of extra sustain. A lot more than I thought it would, actually. Like, I hit him twice for an extra 344 damage, but... Also kept me healthy through the, the 600 damage that I took. I'll take a, I'll take a hit to give a poly auto, why not? Alright, cool. Phoenix is down. Not scared of him. Maybe I should be. I'm not. Uh, the Bancrofts. Oh, yikes. Oh, three crits in a row. Be lucky. And that should be game. Should be game. I don't do the most damage to objectives. But uh, I do have a full minion wave here. I do have Polynomicon, and I do have uh, Rata Tahuti, which does work against Titan, so we should be able to win here. Awesome. GG, that's two Nox dubs back to back. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, make sure to uh, like, comment, and subscribe. And until next time, guys, peace.